Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we are going to discuss about the battle fought between Guru Gobind Singh Ji and Aurangzeb. We all know that Guru Gobind Singh Ji was the leader of the Sikh faith and he was the 10th Guru of the Sikh. He was renowned for his valor and resolve and the founder of the Khalsa Panth. While on the other hand, if we talk about Aurangzeb, he was the Mughal emperor who was known for his strict policies and conflicts with non-Muslim communities. In this video, we will be discussing some series of confrontation which were fueled by religious and political tension in the late 17th century. So, the first battle was Battle of Bhangani. The Battle of Bhangani took place in 1688 between the forces of Guru Gobind Singh, the 10th Sikh Guru and the hill chief of the Shivalik Hills in present-day Himachal Pradesh, India. Guru Gobind Singh fought to defend the rights of the local Raja of the area, Raja Bhim Chand, against the rival chief who sought to oppress him. The battle resulted in the victory for Guru Gobind Singh, securing the rights and territories of Raja Bhim Chand. The background of the battle involved a dispute between Raja Fateh Shah, a local ruler, and Raja Bhim Chand, a supporter of Guru Gobind Singh. Guru Gobind Singh, in support of Raja Bhim Chand, faced the combined forces of various hill chiefs including Raja Fateh Shah. Despite being outnumbered, Guru Gobind Singh displayed remarkable leadership and strategy. The battle resulted in the defeat of the hill chief with Guru Gobind Singh Ji emerging victorious. This victory solidified the Guru's influence in the region and established the Sikh community as a significant military force. The Battle of Bhangani is considered a historic event in Sikh history, showcasing Guru Gobind Singh's military acumen and the courage of the Sikh warriors. The second battle was the Battle of Nadon. The Battle of Nadon took place in 1691 between the Sikh forces led by the Guru Gobind Singh and the Mughal forces under the command of Alif Khan. It was a significant engagement between Guru Gobind Singh's defensive campaigns against the Mughal ruler. The battle unfolded near the town of Nadon in the Kangra district of present-day Himachal Pradesh, India. Guru Gobind Singh Ji along with his Sikhs faced a larger Mughal force. Despite being outnumbered, the Sikh forces displayed exceptional valor and a strategic skill. In the end, Guru Gobind Singh and his forces emerged victorious in the Battle of Nadon. This victory further solidified the Guru's rep reputation as a military leader and contributed to the growing influence of the Sikh community in the region. The third battle was the Battle of Anandpur, which was also known as the Seas of Anandpur. It was a series of conflict that took place between the Sikh forces led by Guru Gobind Singh and the Mughal and Hill Rajput forces from 1700 to 1705. Anandpur Sahib was a significant center for the Sikh, faced prolonged sieges and battles during this period. The conflict were triggered by the animosity of the Mughal authorities, particularly Wazir Khan and the hill chieftains toward Guru Gobind Singh and the Sikh community. Despite facing immense hardship, including shortages of food and resources, the Sikh forces defended Anandpur Sahib with determination. The situation escalated, leading to the evacuation of Anandpur Sahib under an agreement. However, as Guru Gobind Singh and the Sikhs were leaving, they faced a fierce confrontation at the Battle of Chamkor in 1704. Ultimately, the prolonged hostilities culminated in the tragic Battle of Muktsar in 1705, where the Sikhs faced a dire situation but displayed remarkable courage and determination. The period of the Battle of Anandpur marked a significant chapter in Sikh history, showcasing the resilience and sacrifices of the Sikh community under the leadership of the Guru Gobind Singh Ji. As we talked about Battle of Chamkor recently, so let us discuss it in detail. The Battle of Chamkor took place on December 22, 1704 between the Sikh forces led by Guru Gobind Singh and the Mughal forces. 
it was a pivotal conflict during the siege of Anandpur Sahib. As Guru Gobind Singh and a small group of his followers were leaving the besieged Anandpur Sahib, they found themselves surrounded by a much larger Mughal force. In the ensuing battle at Chamkor, Guru Gobind Singh and his sons Sahib Zada Ajit Singh and Sahib Zada Juhazar Singh along with his few loyal Sikh faced overwhelming odds. Despite being vastly outnumbered, the Sikhs fought with incredible bravery. Guru Gobind Singh's sons were martyred in the battle and the Guru himself along with a handful of surviving Sikhs managed to break through the encirclement. The Battle of Chamkor is significant in Sikh history as it exemplifies the sacrifice, courage and resilience of the Sikh community during a challenging period. The martyrdom of Guru Gobind Singh's son is remembered with great reverence in Sikh tradition. Now let us discuss the Battle of Muktsar, which is also known as the Battle of Khidrana. It occurred on December 29, 1705. It was a significant event in the Sikh history following the evacuation of Anandpur Sahib during the tumultuous times of Guru Gobind Singh Ji. After leaving Anandpur Sahib and enduring significant hardship, Guru Gobind Singh and a group of Sikhs took refuge in the Khidrana region, which is now known as the Muksar. The Guru and his followers were pursued by the Mughal forces and the hill chief. In the Battle of Muksar, a small band of Sikh known as the Chali Mukte, 40 liberated ones, faced a much larger Mughal force. Despite being outnumbered, the Sikh fought valiantly. The battle resulted in a significant loss of life, but the Sikhs managed to hold their ground. The Battle of Muksar is commemorated annually during the festival of Maghi, which marks the sacrifice and bravery of the Chali Mukte. It holds a special place in Sikh history for the valor displayed by a small group of Sikh in the face of adversity. So now we can conclude that these battles they inspired a legacy of resilience and perseverance within the Sikh community. And Guru Govind Singh's sacrifices and valor, they left an indelible mark on Sikh history and identity. So guys, if you liked it, don't forget to like, share and subscribe my YouTube channel for regular updates. Till then, bye!